Welcome back, Nana here. And then in this record, we are going to see about how to bypass the successive approvers. My manager has gone on leave, and his manager, his manager has also gone on leave. So how to bypass these approvals and then get the things approved by the requester himself? You want to see this one? So go there. You want to go to the share video? And then you go there. And then let me go and then create a new one. I'm not creating a new requisition now. I have EMP one. Click on more only. So let the requisition line. So I will now put the item over here. <clears throat> Putting some item. I will now already. We have something at the cart. Let me delete it now. And then let me add to the cart. So the item is now deleted. So let me add this line into the cart. And then we will now review it. So once you review it, now coming. Oh, that one. Is the item? Can you add to cart? No, but come over there. So click on this, and then click on the review now. So once when you go into the main requisition page, I will now click on the manage approvals. So here approval is basically a list building mechanism. It is going to build the list of approvers. It says EMP two, EMP three, and then finally application developer. Application developer is basically for automatic. So let me submit for it. So he is my boss, and then EMP three is the boss of EMP two. I am EMP one, and then finally an automatic approval has been designed. I click on submit. So I submitted one zero two eight now. So it will not take some time for the system to generate the list of approvers. This list building mechanism will not be coming immediately. If you click on it, not sure enough now. So you wait for some time now. So once when you wait for it, you go there, go inside now, and then click on the pending approval now. So the list building mechanism will be sending it first to EMP two because it is a serial approver, and then approvals to EMP three, and then finally automatic. So if you click on it, you can now see again. So some time has elapsed. Now it has gone. Now you can see EMP two is in a grey color, and then you can now see the camera icon is enabled actually. On this, for EMP three, it is not done because it has been assigned to EMP two. Now I am now logged in as EMP one, and then I am seeing it now. So what I will do is I will now click on this uh, camera icon. Now my boss has gone on a tour now, so I want to skip it and then send it to EMP three now. So I am giving it. So go to the actions and then skip the current assignment. So once when you click on the actions and then click on skip current assignment, it will now skip the EMP two and then it will now go to EMP three. I'm going to click on it and then click on done now. <clears throat> And then come there. So EMP two is in blue color now. Click on that. And again, click on the pending approval. You can now see the requisition has skipped him and then gone to EMP three now. EMP two is now skipped. It's no more there now. So it's only EMP three. Let me say he is also on a tour. So I want to skip him. I click on it. So click on the camera icon and then skip him now. So click on the camera icon and I can skip it. Now. So go to actions and then go to skip the current assignment. Now it will now go to the application developer automatically. Application developer is nothing but an automatic assignment. Automatic approval. So go there, close it now. So it will now get approved. Now. If you click on done now, you can now see it getting approved. So if you click again on pending approval, if you click on pending approval, you can now see the task is completed. The application developer is approved now. So this way we can bypass anybody actually. <clears throat> so application developer is approved. The task is completed. If you click on done now, now you can see that the request will be in approved state. If you click on done and then come out of it, one zero two eight will be in approved state. So you can now see it's approved. One zero two eight is approved. So this way we can very well bypass the present approvers, and then whichever way you want to approve, we can very well bypass, and then we can now take it up via this. Only thing is the last one you must have an automatic approval. If you don't have an automatic approval, the last it will now get rejected. Remember, if on two and three you are bypassing it, it will now get rejected because the system is not having any approvers. It needs an approval mechanism. The approval mechanism is nothing but a list building mechanism. So at least one automatic approval must be there in the bottom actually. Otherwise, it will fail actually if you are bypassing it. you are doing it properly it's okay okay so bye for now and i will now meet on some other video